Hello, B vs B fans, and today it's a special video, and I've actually got a live audience with me, uh, who is, uh, it's their final day, actually, and I thought as part of their final day, we could do a focus group, because we've been learning all about focus groups, and I was going to do it with a caterpillar, but it's got so many allergies and God knows what else involved in it, that I thought we'd swap it and we'd do what M&S pride themselves on, which is Percy the Pig. So, can you tell the difference between Percy the Pig, £1.60 in Marks and Spencer's, against the little version, which is £1.10, slightly bigger, by the way, pack, or, that's the Henry the Hippo, by the way, or Leo the Lion from Aldi, which is actually the cheapest on test, at 95 pence. You get to test them and basically say whether they prefer the M&S one, the Henry the Hippo, or Leo the Lion. Basically... It's all about a taste test and a focus group. Who comes out on top? Is it going to be Aldi? Is it going to be Lidl? Or is it going to be Mox Spencer's? Let's find out. So then, the results of the taste test are quite interesting. Remember that Mox Spencer's was the most expensive uh, product, where the cheapest was actually the Aldi. Now, interestingly, going round everybody who sampled, Gary, who sampled all three, thought that actually number one, which was the Aldi version of Leo the Lion, was the most flavourable, and he wasn't really a fan of number three, Marks and Spencer's Pepper Pig. That was replicated by Lewis, who thought exactly the same. He was, he was taken by number two's flavour. He preferred number two, the Lidl's Hippo, but he actually did feel that number one, Aldi's Leo the Lion, was the best again. Charlie was definitely adamant number one was the best one for Charlie. She was uh, really adamant that she preferred number one. Uh, she was not a fan of number three, so Marks and Spencer's again was coming out bottom there. And Emma, um, with her interpretations, um, believed that number one was the best. However, she didn't quite understand that they all were different shapes. Emma thought they were all the same <laughs> shape. Um, so... So presentation-wise, in fairness, Charlie did say that M&S's shape and presentation was the best. I remember when we showed her, the, uh, she said, this one looks like a pig. Um, so clearly, M&S was the best, maybe, when it came to the shaping. But when it came to the flavour and the taste, everybody preferred Aldi. Now, that's quite interesting because it was a blind taste test. Okay, it's a small sample size, but that's how our focus group works. So you go around, you taste them, you sample them, and you see what you get. And in our case... Aldi has come out as a winner. So Aldi, with their cheap Leo the Lion, is actually a victorious over Percy the Pig.